What is up, y'all boys? That boy Mel back with another one, man. And I told y'all we're gonna be back sooner than ever. So um, I'm gonna make this intro short and simple. I don't wanna um, I don't wanna keep y'all waiting too long. So today we're gonna be I'm gonna be showing you how I wash my car. Me personally, how I wash my car step by step. I'm gonna show you the products first, but I'm gonna leave a stamp where I start washing the car. So I don't wanna keep y'all waiting. I don't wanna I don't wanna make this intro too long. So let's get to it. All right, yeah, boys, we have made it to my mom crib. So we're gonna start this. Um, like I but said, what the hell, I don't wanna keep y'all waiting too long. So let's get into it. I'm gonna take everything out of the car, put everything lined up. And I'm gonna show you step by step. All right, my, let's get started. So I have this, it's for cleaning my, that's it, this is for cleaning my windows. That's number one, which is always last. This right here, I have tire shine. But this tire shine is not that great because it's links too much, so I don't recommend it. Interior. This is for leather. I don't have leather, so I just use it on certain parts of the car. Um, um, it's 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 all right. I recommend. I don't really recommend it because it it depends how you want to use it. At least next on the line, we got this right here. Um, this one um is to clean off the brake dust, the rims, and all that. So this one is really good. The only problem is that they run out a lot. So. They run out really quick so this is another good product to use in my opinion you're most definitely gonna need one of these if you want to um apply um tire shine on your car so one of these is really good all right another one we got is the turtle shop tire sign this one i recommend a lot this one is really good in my opinion um at least my tire is really good so i recommend this one um you should buy this all right and you cannot forget your smells for the car man this one it's like black ice um if you know what black i'm pretty sure y'all know what black ice is it is so this one's like black ice and this one's similar too um it's from chemical guys um it's all right but this one leaves a really good kick in the car but this one's really good too as well i'm not bashing this one this one's really good as well and finally but not least i have this that i bought not too long ago i bought it like a week ago and i have not tried it out yet so i'm ready to try it out um, Right, yeah boys the first step we do is this is how i do it so watch spray water on the car the whole tire put water on the whole tire then splash it Tires are really 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 dirty you're gonna see some brownish coming out of it like right down here it looks a little bit brown not too crazy but if your tires are really really dirty um they're gonna be really brown so if you need a second pass you should do that but mines are not that dirty because i take care of them and all that so they're not that dirty as you can see all right boys so that's what i do for the tires that's the only thing I really do. I really don't get inside of the uh, of the of these knobs and all that and the inside. I don't really mind because that always gets really dirty. So I don't really pay too much attention to this. I know you should, but I really don't because it gets dirty real quick. So.
right, y'all boys. So we're gonna use the cannon. So first, I'm gonna spray water on the car. So let's get that out of the way first. We're gonna put water on the I'm whip. Oh yeah, well you gotta set it up, I saw a YouTube video, let's see if it actually works. Oh shit, okay. Um, honestly? Ooh, pretty nice. Look at this. Ooh, interesting. <laughs> oh my god, this, this is so much better, bro. It helps me out a lot, dog. Oh my god, it actually works. Jesus Christ. Alright. Alright. It's not doing a bottle a lot, though. Go fast to get all them cracks. Alright. Get up there on top. Honestly, 10 out of 10 product. And it's cheap, honestly. So, it's really good, my pen. All right, yeah, boys, <laughs> we have finished washing her. I took my time with her, you already know. Um, so now I'm gonna dry her up. So I'm not I'm not gonna show you that process because you know, it's like common sense. Um, you just gotta dry her up and everything. And um, I'm trying to do this as quick as possible for y'all. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna do the interior because it's not that dirty. So, but for y'all boys, I'm gonna just show you. I'm gonna just show you the basics. Um, I'm not gonna vacuum it though, it's not that crazy, so. I'm gonna just clean like this stuff and the dash and the steering wheel, the basic things I do, right? And yeah, let's get to it. So we gotta dry her up and oh, and one one major step when you're washing a car, man, make sure to clean right here. These, bro, this is an essential in my opinion for a car. Right here, when they when people goes in the car, obviously they see all this and it's dirty. And, um, you know, you know what I mean. But yeah clean this make sure to clean this i always clean this after i finish everything this washing the car and be honest with me how i did look at this bro this is amazing um i consider myself a good washer for cars um when i wash other people's cars i can i think like it's my car i'm washing you know to do a good job and everything so now we're gonna do the glass um tire shine and interior so i think i'm gonna do glass first then I'll do interior and then I'll do tire shine. I always leave tire shine for last. And I got a tip for tire shine at the end, so stay tuned and I'll catch you in a bit. Yeah, boys. Let me turn off the car, it's too much heat. I hope you can see the difference of the tires on camera because um, you know, obviously in person it looks, it looks really good right now so in person i hope this looks really good i mean in person i hope in camera this looks really good so this is how you do it it's not nothing out of this world so usually i spray a little bit more not too crazy and then i give it another pass but that's about it so then when you're done with this um let it sit for five minutes because if not it's gonna be slinging everywhere so when you're done with this with every five tires um obviously the last one the last tire you do you're gonna have to wait five more five minutes for that one as well but when i'm pretty sure when you finish with the other with the with the with that last one the other ones are gonna be ready so let's move on to the next one Spray.
the chair I'm sitting on just threw some water at me and it was brown. That means that's rust. So I had to take my shirt off. That's my problem. I'm almost sweaty. Just came out of the water. All right, so this makes your tires look so dope. But this is the reason why I brush my tires too. Obviously, you gotta um, take off the accent. Not accent, but yeah. the, this layer that you put on from the first time. Obviously, you gotta take it off so you can apply more. So you don't wanna have layers on top of layers on top of layers. Obviously, it's not gonna look good. Um, I have bad experiences with other um, with other um with other products but this tire shine turtle tire shine bro this is this is amazing this right here is an amazing product in my opinion so um i recommend it i recommend this product i bought this because the other one i showed you at the beginning it's it was terrible honestly it slinged all over my car so when i washed it all this was just dark and like little spots everywhere so i'm pretty sure y'all seen that i never will uh, i'm not the only one all right so let's move on to the last one i'm gonna get right here and i'm gonna walk all right yeah boys that is the end of the tire shine man um yeah, if you see hopefully it looks a little bit different on camera obviously obviously you know camera never tells the truth but look at this one this one pretty sure this one looks shiny right yeah look at that hold on let me fix my settings on my camera so yeah, yeah boys here we have it look at the difference look at that that looks amazing in my opinion this one as well so this ones are drying up are sort of drying up let's see how this one's over here doing you see this one is almost fully dried up so we let that sit you could tell the difference look you could tell the difference so so yeah um and that is it yeah boys there's nothing out of this world it's so simple i didn't vacuum it because it's not that dirty so it wasn't the i just cleaned the dash and all that just to show you what i do but yeah that's about it man um, there's nothing too crazy about this. There's no science behind this. It's common sense. And um, I'll catch you on the next one, man. Thank you for watching. Um, and I appreciate the love on the last video with my sister. And soon, give me some comments down below. Um, some, some questions what to ask my sister. So I'll catch you on the next one.